one is um it's again it's one of the sort of more darker and combative uh tunes and it's uh it's from the point of view of someone who is uh being accused of infidelity and of really you know telling this person you know that that's not what's going on here and you know it, the only thing that's really going to destroy this relationship is is you being so suspicious <laughs> and so you know and so single-minded about looking to find this thing that's that is wrong in this infidelity and this betrayal that hasn't actually happened. You know? I guess you know in, in any sort of relationship, if it's if it's monogamous, you know that can come up from time to time depending on your lifestyles, right? Sure. So it fits well, into of the course, jealousy of, and or even you know. if it's in your head. Mm -hmm. even if it's in your head. Well, that's yeah. the thing is that if if it is just in your head, yeah, it's just sure. as destructive as yeah. if it's if it's really happened. And I I kind of like that image of you know, thirsty for my tears, you know, it's like, it why, yeah. why would, you know, why would anyone be thirsty for your tears? But if, if you have that sort of vengeful, uh, you know, feeling towards someone, then maybe that, that's how you feel, mm. is you want to see them cry, you want to see them suffer in the way that they've made you suffer. You know?